bottle caps and toll tabs of stinking Lincolns at the bar. My old age, 250, is about wore out. And my last digger's dog digging in the frozen ground. So I can't see, and I know I'm a hillbilly. Jack Squat, uh, January 6, 2011. We'll go down to the park, start to snow again. Gloomy, cloudy, crappy, cold. It's one, uh, 109 or 108 in the afternoon. Looks like it's about dark. So, I don't know. Might go down there a little bit and park, see if I can dig. Call his man, see if he wants to go after work. So, we'll go down there, so. I guess if I get back with you, I went. Is it just me or on crappy days like this when you're down in the dumps anyway because it's really crappy outside? They always play crappy music on the radio. It's like every radio station's got to play crappy songs on a crappy day. I mean, hell, you're already depressed. There we go. Lisa's upbeat. All right, it's uh, 1.49, been snowing, road's covered already, so, anyway, I'm going to go to the park, this man ain't going, so, maybe I can see if I can find some soft ground down there. All right, down here at the park, first, first good coin signal I got here. Maybe. Well, that's why I like doing live digs. <laughs> there it is. Like a dime. Glad dime. Alrighty. Get back with you. Look at this. Damn. Yep. It's frozen over here. Not a shallow penny. At least I ought to find it. No, that's there it is. Stinking sinking. Big old scratch on it. Digging this cave here. Had a broken coin signal. The first thing I dug up was a lead sinker, so I kept getting a good signal way down in there around them roots. Hell, I thought man, I had something good. Junk. Now they're stinking. Might be something else down there. Nope. Yep, got silver. Looks like a 1986 bottle cap. Got a coin spill here. Just dug up a stinking and a, 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 a clad rosy right there where my foot is. I just pulled a penny out of this hole. I got signals. Something there. But there's another coin. Stinking Lincoln. Memorial. Something there's plug too, I think. I thought there was. Maybe not. Hell, the way the detector was going off, I act like there was a bunch of crap in there. Something in there. Maybe I gotta dig for it. All right, guess I'll dig for it. How the, how the damn pinpointer wasn't on. Right there. Where'd you go? So 
something in there, I guess. They're stinking sinking. Yep, guess that hole was used up. That's dug down about, about five inches there, had a penny signal. How I dug and dug and dug for that thing, and I got a hold of it, and you could tell it was a copper penny. And how I, man, I, I thought for sure I had a damn weed or an Indian head. 1980. It sucks when the, when the modern day stuff's deep. It's doing pretty good still. I'll be wrapping it up here and going to the house here shortly. So. Yeah, I'm a few feet over from where I just dug that deep penny. I got this clad dimer. Hell, that thing was down there too. Everything over there was shallow, but getting deeper over here. Well, I'm gonna go to the house. Look at this thing. This <laughs> one's for you, Groundswell. It's gonna be grizzly. In just a second. Alright, I'm back home. Here's my finds for the day. Fish and sinker. Five clap dimes, junk, and uh, eleven zinkins. Well there's a couple of coppers in there I guess. Micah, there's my that's a piece of 130 pound rail there. Come off the main. You still see where the the uh there's a joint there and they had to, this is for the circuit, for the signals and the crossing flashers and everything. And uh, this piece here was my grandpa's. He got it somewhere I think, so I cut it and made a point on it in there. Small rail there, I don't know what the hell that come off of. Wasn't no main though, but anyway that stuff is.